Today what we're looking at is we're looking at another breaker box. A breaker box is always an adventure, also one of the most dangerous places in the home. Uh, today I'm just looking at the breaker sizes to the wiring sizes, making sure that the right amperage to the wire is all the is correct. Now what I also want to show you here is the how important it is that we look at the le uh, the aluminum wiring. You see the aluminum wiring is our our silver wiring, and then you can see it on our pan our neutral bar over here too. There's nothing wrong with aluminum wiring. It gets a bad rap. A lot of the trailers used to have it, uh, and this is what we call Vietnam wiring. This wiring was put in the home during the during the, uh, the Vietnam War, and uh, the reason was is because we needed the copper. Uh, this, now, what, I'm, what you need to do is make sure that what happens is aluminum contracts and expands. And when it does that, then it has a tendency to overheat and, and it makes it loose. The connection loose. When the connection gets loose, then what happens is, is that, uh, that, that it creates a, a fire hazard because now it's sparking to get across. If you ever have an outlet that feels hot to the touch, you have aluminum wiring, this is where you need to be taking care of it. Uh, switch it over. They have special outlets and switches. Uh, they're like three or four bucks a piece. Uh, just replace it. Uh, but any other time, don't worry about it. Don't replace it unless you have start noticing problems. Anyway, this breaker box looks real good. There's a 100 amp service. You can always tell by looking at the wiring. Whoops, and there we go. I'm just having a hard time getting that one focused in here. But anyway, this is a 100 amp service. Plenty of service for this home. Thank you, folks. I hope you enjoyed our videos, and you have a great day.